and we're back. Punisher takes us back on the floor. More with the close fist punches. I have a feeling this is going to be a bloodbath when all is said and done. I can't believe the Punisher broke out the Scotch Destroyer on William Wallace earlier on. He's got to take on unconventional style to take on a very unconventional performer in William Wallace. Wallace with the ring steps. Nails Punisher once. Punisher still getting up from all this. I don't like what this man did at Colossal Tussle, but I respect him. Ah! Oh! With the ring bell. Same thing that gave Chaz Michael Michaels a concussion. Oh, now they're fucking with my table. Oh, that's my table. That two other people are standing in. Punisher's not lighting up. Ah, oh, Spinebuster onto the table. And he's going to take out the Spanish announce table. Backbreaker. Turn into a neckbreaker. He just hit the Scott Slam. The Punisher hit his own version of the Scott Slam. Bulldog by Wallace. How is he able to compete? Let alone get the Punisher on that table. What's he going to do here? Oh my god! Holy Moesha! And he's got a sledgehammer. The same way the Punisher used on William Wallace at, at Colossal Tussle. And William Wallace and, and, and the Punisher are getting up close and personal with the fans. Wallace throws him over, throws the Punisher over the barricades. I'm sure a couple NTA fans took a couple of shots at him too while he was down. Kick him! Kick him! Punch him in the deck! And the advantage so far is all Punisher at this, William Wallace at this point, sorry, I was going to say, It's looking extremely favorable to William Wallace at this point. If he hits the Scotch Destroyer right here, this very well could be the end. And Frank Castle showing the Frank Castle showing William Wallace he still has some fight left in him. He's not a call legend for nothing. And there they go back to wrestling. A forearm for a forearm. Back collar tie up. Side headlock. And punch. Ah, and yes, there will be blood. What the fuck? Wallace is... Scottish Destroyer! Scottish Destroyer! Scottish Destroyer! And Frank Castle's up! 
and he's a Scotch Destroyer of his own! These two men are letting them both all hang out! And we're not talking about penises. Not another cocky dick penis reference. But they are letting it all hang out. In their pants. He's got ill intent with that table. Lay drop! Through a table! OMFG! Ah, uh, this is it. Two and stick a fork. No! going for the pinfall and no I gotta say this after taking that from William Wallace Frank Castle is not gonna be in the same shape when, when it comes time for random verdict Turnbuckle. I know that expression. Scott Slam. Actually, face front. Scott Slam. One, two, stick a fork. No. Discus punch. No! European uppercut! And a devastating backbreaker to follow! He's gonna hit the Scottish Destroyer! Scottish Destroyer! Oh my god! Barbecue sauce! Good god! This has gotta be it! One, two, and throw no! How'd he kick out? He's working that already injured knee. It looks like he brought a trash can to take out the trash. And that whip got turned into a loop press press. What else does, what else does Frank Castle up, have up his sleeve? Whoa! RVD style! Stick a fork in him! Two! Three! No! I feel sore just for having watched this match. Oh no, he's not gonna do this. His leg's already injured. Stop this, ref, get the- No! Fuck you, you pig fucking pig fucker who fucks pigs! He's gonna do it again! No! Okay, ref, it's time to call this thing. It's one thing to win a match. It's one thing to lose a match. But we're talking about a man's livelihood. Ah! He's working that already injured leg.